Want to take a minute to say what's up? Welcome back to more Elden Ring. Had a lot of fun with this series so far. We kind of just been, uh, I mean, we've just been exploring a lot. This game is massive. It's like an 80-hour plus game, and I've just been kind of just slowly chipping away at it. So I appreciate all the active support each day. I've been kind of trying to stay, I guess, consistent with the uploads, and uh, all the support means a lot to me. So love you all. Best audience ever. Let's get it. All right, it's a little dark. Uh, welcome back to more Elden Ring. Appreciate all the support. I know I already said all that in the intro, but technically, I haven't done the intro yet. So, I kind of farmed this area until I got my intelligence to 12. Um, I found an area. Now, I didn't look online for this, I, I promise you. But, somebody on Twitter sent this to me. Over here, there is apparently an enemy that drops a staff. Where we can finally use magic spells. I want to go there first. I went over there just to make sure it wasn't some BS, you know? <laughs> That's like, well, are you are you playing games or what? So, here we go. Um, I'm going to go over there, fight whatever enemy this is. Wait, let me mark it. But yeah, appreciate all the support, man. This has been a, it's been an amazing game. Now, I know I'm really early on in the game. Uh, what I was going to do in this video... Oh, by the way, since I'm already recording, let me go ahead and... Uh, let me go ahead and do this really quick. I want to see if I had any... I think I had more golden, golden seeds? Oh, is that what it's actually called? Let me double check. Yeah, three. Okay. I, I think you need two to level up the flasks. Uh, adds a charge. I think... Yeah, two of these. Now, I don't know if it's going to be after this, like, diminishing returns. By the way, what I'm going to do going forward, if you want more of this series, you know... Uh, I'm going to make the videos longer, kind of like that last one. I was First, I started out like, you know, 25 to 30 minutes. Then it's like a casual 30. I think upwards to 40 minutes is a good is a good time chunk. You know what I'm saying? All right. I wonder what the allocation is, though. Six to one. See, I, I would even just put it all on seven. But I would assume that if I increase... If, if I level up and I add more FP, which is all in mind. I just, I don't know what it is. I'm not sold on it. Now, th those abilities are nice. But you don't need that many to actually take down an enemy. Alright, we're gonna go this way. I tested, like, going out over here, and it, it's kind of weird. Like, first off, you can't jump normally. You would think, like, how do you how do you get up there? What I did, I just, like, did this. There's probably another way to get up there. Oh, that's close. Hold on, let me see if I can do it again. Man, that, man, that's really close. I did this earlier. Of course, when I'm recording, I can't. There we go. Now, I did die once doing this. <laughs> Definitely an odd thing. I will say this. As far as games with horses, I don't like a lot of the horse gameplay in most games. Assassin's Creed Valhalla, Ghost of Tsushima. Uh, what am I missing? A few others. I just feel like... Oh, yeah, I think I am going to take a little damage here. That's, a, that's actually a lot longer of a drop than I thought. Uh, hold on. Yeah, here we go. I'm not going to jump or anything. I actually survived that. Okay. I'm actually surprised it added, like, the weather effects, like the raining and stuff, because I would imagine that hurts the frames. I mean, you got the tree already kind of taking up a large chunk of everything. Um, but yeah, I've had, I've had a lot of fun with this game. What I want to do is get this staff if this is legit. What we got here? What is this? I was supposed to follow the footprints, I guess. This game has so much stuff to do. It's here's what's different about this than most open world games. Most open world games have a restricted area where you don't want to go there. You can go anywhere in this game from the jump. As long as you're good enough, that is. Are you about to just plummet down or something? Uh. Elliot? I see the footsteps. No idea where we're going. Oh, next time I get a chance, I'm going to buy a uh, torch, by the way. 
Oh, look. There's a, hold on. There's a safe spot down here. Interesting. I mean, I'm assuming this is where this is going. I guess it was just kind of like showing me that... Okay. It was just showing me like, hey, this is down here, by the way. Earth Bore Cave. Okay. Let me go ahead and save it. Or not save it, but rest here. Now that this is discovered. Now, there's a, there's a chest right there. Ah, oh, let's just do this. Am I going to get attacked in here? First off, I can't see anything. Okay. You know what? I had a feeling it was going to be something like that. Wait, is that a bear? I don't even know what I'm fighting right now, guys. I don't know what I'm fighting. I literally can't even see it. It's so dark. I'm just swinging right now. I need to heal up. Apparently, there's like enemies all around me. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, first off, I can't see anything. Follow this. Golden rune. I love it. Hey, here we go. That was kind of unexpected. Yeah, I definitely need... I need like a torch down here. I thought that was a giant that didn't move. I like held up my word there for a minute. <laughs> Say, wait a minute. Glowstone, alright. Uh, there's got to be a way out of here, right? I literally can't see. Do I have something that like glows in the dark? Uh, I I don't know where I'm going. It is beyond dark down here. Um, oh, I can't fast travel out of here. Well, you guys might be able to see better than I can right now. I can't see anything. Acquire materials? Okay. I will craft a firebomb if I have to get out of here. Cave moss. Okay. Yeah, I should have crafted. I think it also might, might be because I have a... Uh... Oh my god. Here it goes. And there's all my stuff. It is gonna be a fight! Let's go! Oh my god! I wasn't prepared for this! Jesus! I'm causing bleed effect, I think. Or maybe it's causing that on me, I don't know. Oh god! That's a charge attack if I've ever seen one. Oh, let's go! Not gonna do a lot, probably. Yes, let's go. Oh no! Let's go, man. First try, let's get it. Woo, okay. First, it, it started out like, uh, it's, that's the beauty of this game, right? I followed a, here's how this video went. Upgraded my flask once and was like, hey, let's go get this other thing. Sidetracked by a glowing skeleton that led me to some dark cave. Then it was too dark and I was swinging for my life down here with no, no light. And then I fought an actual bear boss, like, that is... Let me see what we got. We got a talisman. Um, boost magical damage negation. All right. I like this one. Still enhances charge attacks. We don't know about how how much. It doesn't really say. Uh, I'm gonna assume. Now, what I did against that enemy, I was like this. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I was just going after it. All right. That was fun. That was a nice fight too. It felt like. It, like, the one I haven't really felt like has been fair was that Crucible Knight, like, couple parts back. Like, that, like, I thought the last video when I fought Margit, uh, was gonna, like, ruin my night. 
<laughs> I thought I was like legitimately at the beginning. You can hear it in my voice. I'm like, well, I guess I'll go do this really quick. I was like, the last time I fought that enemy, I was there for hours. And it like ruined my day. <laughs> so I'm I'm just glad that nothing has really been too tough. Now that one yeah, like the dragon in the last video, that's obviously that was a you're gonna stumble upon areas that are if I had to guess like like you're not supposed to be there. It's open world, but it's also like, hey, you can like as soon as you hit a single enemy, you're like, I already know that I should not be out here. You know what I'm saying? Oh, we fought a boss. Met my uh, my my quota for the video. I had no idea what I was doing. That does so much damage. I don't know what the damage scale of this one is. Obviously, this weapon's good for right now. Later on, it it won't. You know, it probably won't even be anything I even keep in my inventory anymore. But for right now, I love it. I think if you do enough hits with it, it, it causes like a bleed effect. Alright, looks like we got... I think it's right here in front of me. There we go. I got a sword for that? Really? Man, I, I just... I'm taken back right now to when I played Castlevania Symphony of the Night for the first time. There was no, no guide. I put that beacon way far away, didn't I? Um... The enemy, I think, is in here. Yeah, that that has to be it. I think that giant staff it has. Now, I don't know if that's the one I'm getting. I'm assuming it's like a smaller version of that. I don't know. If the, I think this might be a boss. Here we go. And there's other enemies. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's kind of hard to avoid complete spoilers for this type of game because it's literally been trending on Twitter for the last, like, couple days um, when it came out, so. How much health you got? Uh, pretty good amount. I need to kill all the other enemies first, I think. Oh, my God. Let me run back here really quick and heal. Double? There we go. I'm assuming this thing can break down the walls. Yo, shooting through that. I was actually... I, I came with that second hit actually hit. There we go. Nice. Demi Human Queen Staff. I got my first staff. Nice. Let me get this as well. Well, that's it for the video, I guess. Mission accomplished. No, I'm kidding. That's funny. That's a good... Hey, this has been a solid one so far. I really appreciate all the support. All right. Here's what I want to try. Um, I need to put some of this stuff up. I'm going to have so many different weapons. Put that there. I'm assuming... Do I... I mean... Oh, maybe I'm tripping. I don't know. What do I need to use this? Six strength, ten intellect. I mean, I already have that. Maybe it doesn't work like that. Oh, I just realized something. No? I'll look into it later. Um, it's probably something I'm missing. Maybe there's certain areas you can't cast magic. I don't even know if this thing works with these spells I have equipped, by the way. I have enough FP and all that, so I'm assuming all that's good. I'll look into it later, though. For now, what I wanted to do was just go explore the area. Hold on. Yeah, I'll kind of look into the staffs and stuff. I'm not sure how that works. Maybe I have to hit a certain point in the game or get a certain item. Um, all right. Did all that. Um, this is where we were last time. Now, here's what's weird. This has like a line going... I'm guessing it's going up or down. I can't really tell the difference. It looks like these are pointing towards it. And this is pointing down like it's a main area. I thought there was just one row of lines, but I guess not. All right, let's go here. This is kind of the Stormvale main gate area right after the first... I would call it the cutscene boss, if you would. Yeah. 
this feels like the area you should go next. I think I've been everywhere. C come over here, would you? See what we got. You, you're, you're tarnished, aren't you? I would advise against taking the main gate into the castle. It's tightly guarded by hardened old hands. Oh, tr tr try the opening right here. The guards don't know about it. You'll breach the castle undetected. All right. I'll say very, very well, I guess. Yes, that's the spirit. You're just the kind of tarnish that I like. I pray for your success. Now, I don't really know what he's talking about as far as like the main gate versus like going around. Um, but this, anytime I see this castle, I'm thinking about the beginning of Demon's Souls. You know what I'm saying? So many pools now functional. Oh, by the way, I've been playing offline this entire time. I probably should turn it on so I can see all the stuff people are talking about. Um, all right, I think I need to use my horse here. Oh, I can't. Well, we're not going down there, that's for sure. Summoning pool. I mean, this looks like you hop down here. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Got a couple things down here, too. That's one of the... Uh, it's like... Like I was saying earlier. Castlevania Symphony of the Night. One of my all-time favorite games. I love that it's like... What I would be doing in that game is hitting walls randomly. I don't think... Oh, yeah. I can't summon down here. So, I was going to try to use the horse. Hop up there and get that. But you have to come up from the other side to get it. Yeah. It's the same thing. It's like you'll see an item like a cross right there. Can't get it right now, but later on we probably can. You know what I'm saying? Or maybe I can just go around this wall and get it. But it's like the Metroidvania style stuff. You'll always come back to an area you've been to before. But you have like a new ability or a new thing where you can fight a, an enemy you probably couldn't before. Certain parts of the game will seem scary in the beginning. Versus like right right now, it's like I feel okay uh, as far as like my le my current level. Now I'm not 100% confident. Uh, for late game right now, I think I've leveled up a little bit more than probably most people at this stage, but I also know, like, we already, we just did a full circle, okay. Um, so you can just come through here anyways. Well, I guess I'll hop down, so I have to go back up. But yeah, it's like that, finding a random item, and it's like, hey, what does this do? And it, it, it'd be something that, like, you've never seen before. Uh, with, I, I'm not watching any guides or anything, so it's just like, it's really nice that I'm finding a lot of this stuff on my own. Alright, I mean, the main gate's right here, so what is... What are we doing here? Heavily guarded. I mean, I see a couple enemies. Can I not just... Is there a switch I can just use? That would be amazing. Really happy I went with uh, playing this on PS5 because I heard a lot of people struggling on PC. There we go. I don't know why I didn't do that the first time. As soon as I saw the ledge, I thought, oh yeah, I can just hop up there. Got a little bit of a friendly creature there. Yeah, I'm going to do some research on the staffing and all that. I think there might be something else I have to do before I can use it. Actually, hold on. Let me double check my inventory. I had an item early on I, I gave to someone. It's like a spell book or something. I think I've already sent it to somebody, though. I need to get rid of some of this stuff in my inventory. I got a lot of things that I'm not even using. All right. Let's see here. All right. Maybe I need to put on... I just realized maybe I need to actually add a... Like an ash thing for it. Um, let's see. Hmm. I don't know. We're gonna hop down here, and we're probably gonna get get caught up in something. Here we go. You can attack me all you want. Come on, let's go. Golly! Hey, take that! Leave me alone.
Although this is like one of the most stressful games I've played in years, it's one of my favorite. <laughs> it's like, it's uh, something about it. We can go down here. Um, we can also, let me look back over here really quick. Seems like there's an area. Well, we got up there, then we got back here. Let's see. Oh, there's another one right there. Man, look at this game. It's like... Almost looks like we're right next to the tree, but we're really not. It's so far away, we don't even know it. Look at that house back there. You know what that, that house kind of reminds me of? What's the house of Resident Evil Village? Ah, forget her name. I shouldn't have forgot it already, but the doll. Angie the doll, but it was like... The woman's house. I, I don't know her name. I cannot remember. It was like all by itself. Why are y'all so tanky? Y'all didn't even give me a hundred XP, if even that. Look at those fangs on. Wait, is that sword? It's like swords on the bottom. That's actually wild. Spinning stone. All right. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna top off my health. Yo, that statue in the back looks so sick. If we can go over there, that would be amazing. It looks like we can eventually. What part of the map are we on? We're still... Here's what's funny. We're still in this area where I got the map fragment. I don't know how large this map is. I'm not. A, I'm assuming it goes further out than what we have here. Because we're like... Yeah, we're not even near the edges, really. I'm assuming it just keeps expanding, you know? Kind of like the universe, which I still don't understand to this day. I'm 35 and I've always wondered, like, how does the universe keep expanding? Spans into, uh... Into what? You know what I'm saying? I, these are the questions I wonder sometimes. Alright, here we go! Oh, I could've just came up through here. There was a spot to rest. How convenient! Let me see something really quick. Oh, you know what I just realized? I have... Let me put this on. I, I kind of wonder how this works. I guess I can't use it yet. I think something... I, I'm kind of missing something here. I think there's like something I have to do that will uh, unlock that. You know what I'm saying? Oh boy. This is gonna go excellent, I can only imagine. You gotta be kidding. Hey. Love it. Yeah, this definitely feels like Demon Souls, uh in the early stage, you're like going around the castle area. Yo, I want to go back there so bad. Oh, so it's like, it's like over, well, yeah, it'd be like over here. I think. That's what it's facing. My icon. Yeah, I'm looking this way. Yeah, that's the house. Okay. Interesting. So we will go there eventually. Oh my god, I thought there was a hole right there. Yeah, this feels more in line when I when I attack these enemies, it feels more like you should you should be here before the other area. Like the area several parts back where I went down the elevator, you know, I felt out of out of place there. You can usually hit like one enemy and just be like, yeah, I'm not supposed to be here. I don't know what's around this wall. Okay, we're good. It's like, it's a challenge, but I'm also leveled up, so it should count for something. Some of those other areas, it felt like, oh, we got hook claws. Yo, I got those in Dying Light, too, as well. That's funny. Hold on, whoa, whoa. let's see what we got here. Anything there? No, okay. We'll go up top. Yes, they do. I had a feeling. I had an 
an idea at the beginning that like, I would get this uh, magic staff and just start being able to use it, but I, I think there's something else I have to do. I'm just going to rush him. Actually does a lot of damage to me. Go ahead and get this. Another enemy up ahead of me. Oh, no. Why does it look so scary? Just standing there in the dark, waiting for somebody. Throwing daggers. I got a lot of those types of items. Let me show you. Uh... Well, I guess I don't. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where they went. Maybe I'm tripping. I don't know. Here they are. Throw at enemies and inflict damage. You get a lot of these at the uh, place I was farming a couple times ago. Uh, the place way up here. Those small enemies I kept farming there. Here we go. Oh, it's locked. Wait, is there anything in there? I can't crouch. There we go. Then you have to, like, complete the dialogue to crouch. We got something to the left right here, too. Okay. So that's how it's going to be. I don't know if you guys watch wrestling at all, but I grew up on that stuff. And I remember when The Undertaker came out to Limp Biscuit. That was like the most hype stuff ever. Keep rolling, rolling. It's like, what in the world? Where are we going? Golden Rune. Okay. Guess we got to go back all the way. Uh, yeah, I got to go back. Cool little area. When I play this game, time just seems to stand still. I literally walked up to my office to uh, to edit the last video, and I'm recording this one because I already had my mic and everything in the right spot and all that, and had all the settings ready. And uh, I was like, I'm gonna record some more of this game right now. These statues, what we, it's like it's really bright right here. Hold on. Yo, it looks like you could go through there, doesn't it? It's kind of like transparent almost. This is open. Okay, nice. <laughs> that was the first time it, like... Oh yeah, you kind of take it. Just what I need. A uh, Crucible Knight-esque boss. Alright, we're going to have to take off the shield here. Okay. I... You were just like him. It's actually insane. Put back on the shield. It won't let me put back on the shield. Yeah, I, I got... It's like, first, I can barely see. And whenever you're on the ground or rolling, you are trying... And whenever you get hit, you can't swap your weapon or your shield or anything. That was odd. I don't think it was that difficult. It wasn't even a boss. I just... It was just an odd area. Really? All the way back here? I don't even think I had that much... Rune wise, but man, that's unfortunate. I'm gonna speed run through this and get my stuff back. Hundred and fourteen. Yeah, you don't even get much for these enemies. I gotta worry about the firebomb guys though. I'm gonna you know what? I'm gonna do this. There we go. That's probably the first time in the game where we had a uh, a section pop up. I went through the door. Now I still have the key, so... There you go. Let him blow that up. 
fine with me. There we go. Easy peasy. Yeah, it, it had like a, I thought it was like, like a cutscene was about to play. Because it was like we, uh, we still got the key and everything. I just thought a cutscene was about to pop up. All right, I think this is the door right here. Let me go ahead and top off my health really quick. Um, not a summon area, so I'm debating how I want to play this. Enemy doesn't have too much health, but here we go again. Just like it's just like Crucible Night. I'm trying to just get away. I'm trying to just get away. Yeah, you're not Crucible Knight, dude. Sorry. Alright, here we go. Oh, Curved Sword Talisman. Okay. It has his guard counters. Woo, that would be nice. Charge attacks? I might have to go ahead and place uh, that on the back burner. There we go. Those two. I only have this one because it raises my HP, but I don't know about how much. 1486. Let's check it out. Oh, wow. It took away 84. <laughs> Let's put it back on. It's like a whole free level. Right right now, if I upgrade my uh, my Viger, it's plus like 25. So I would need three levels. It's almost like it has been level 44 by having that equipped. I thought that was like a main section. It was weird because... What did we come up here for then? Oh, we got to hop down here, I think. Unless... Well, we got a rustic key. I'm assuming that door opened, but this is the one we need to actually go through. There we go. There we go. That was a cool little uh, encounter, though. It was, it was kind of tough because I couldn't see. And I'm guessing people would have to struggle with uh, the light more than anything. Plus, that's a, that's a pretty tanky enemy for not being a boss. Uh, we got a few things here. We got this section. Wait, can I make this? Really? I want whatever item this is. That's all I want. One over there too. Oh, it's this armor. Nice. We got a we got more stuff down here, but I don't want to jump down there yet. Here's what's cool about this game. Any section of the game you go to, you can always come back. That's why I'm not really sweating a lot of this stuff. I also don't want to stick to the critical path all the way. It actually scared me a little bit. Um mainly because this isn't really a game that benefits from doing that. You know what I mean? Because if you go in to fight any enemy early on, it's going to be a tough time. All right. Oh, we're on, we're on like the wall right here. 
Little circles. I remember this. Okay. Now we can go up. I bet you there's something back here on this side, though. Watch there be an item right around here. Yep. I, I, I knew it. Once I saw it, I was like, alright. Mushrooms. I'm just testing the walls out. Some people run around hitting like thousands of walls in this game because there's like, going to be one of them that has like a hidden item in it. I'll hit any of them that kind of pop up and catch my attention. It's another knight right there. Man, I don't want to fight another one of those. Um, I need to save my game. Or not save it, but just like get to a point where I can... Alright, I cannot see right here. But it looks like there's something back here. No? Okay. This might be another tanky enemy. Let me get everything ready. I don't have any hills. That's it. I got this stuff. I might try to go for an assassination attempt here. You don't see anything, buddy. Really? Oh my god. Yes, yeah, same type of enemy. How did that miss? That's gonna kill me. Alright, we got the gauntlets. We're good. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's like a door type thing. Can't break that, obviously. All right, looks like we're going up, or... Oh, there's an elevator down there. Maybe we go all the way to the top, just to have it take us all the way to the bottom? I don't know. Here we go. Contraption does not move, all right. We can go across right here, I think. Yeah, it's kind of it's kind of risky right there. We'll just kind of take it easy. Oh my god, almost died. No safe spot yet. No returning spot either. This is, I don't know what kind of enemy this is. I keep forgetting. I'm going to die. 100%. Oh, I'm getting shot at, too. Hold on, let me back up. Oh, let's go. I can't believe that's there. <laughs> that is amazing. That what What a clutch grace thing right there. Um, long way to go to level up. Ashes of War. It's like, so you can change some of this stuff, but you don't have a lot of options. It's like, maybe each one has a couple different ones. Okay, now I don't fear this enemy up here. Alright, here we go. Oh, that's the guy shooting at me. Pretty cool area. It, it feels like a main section, you know what I'm saying? There's like the areas where you can just go there if you want. Hmm. Oh no. God, there's so many.
Imagine if that hit everybody. That would be so sick. We get shot with the arrows, that's fine. I don't think this hits both of them. Yeah, I don't think it does. Makes you immune for a second, though, which I'll definitely take. Go up here and get whatever this is. So what is the purpose of coming out here? Gotta be a reason, right? Looks like you can hop uh, down and further and further and further. Yeah, there's even a body right there. Hmm. I feel like getting into this might be... Oh, yeah. Jumping from side to side right here. Oh, look where we are, though. It's like you, you look at all these buildings and the castle parts and stuff like that, and it's like... There's so much stuff here, yet... We're on, like, this small little area. <laughs> it just seems like... We haven't even scratched the surface yet. All right, I'm assuming we can hop down. I'll Here's what I'll do. Let me go ahead and collect this. I'm going to run back and save it, and then I'll probably stop the video for now. I'm going to spot in there, it looks like. That's where we just were, I think. Yeah, I'm assuming you hop down like this. I mean, I don't know if this is the right way to go or not. Obviously, you can come here, so I'm assuming... This is somewhat right. Is that one of those things? This does not feel the right way. Uh, probably could have went over there and got that instead. I think I can actually hop down right here and get this. Spinning stall, nice. Problem is, how do you get out of here? <laughs> the ultimate question. Yo, I, I love stuff like this in games. This doesn't even need to be like this. But it's so cool. Got a little area down there. Um, let me try climbing this. Get over here to this item. Maybe. We got that item right there. I'm assuming that's something probably not too important. This is a cool way to like traverse the area. I'm not sure if you can do what. Uh... There we go. I wanted to just like take a little break, but uh, I don't know like where to stop at right now. Oh no. Okay, you know what? Oh my goodness. Uh, I think we're good? We came over here. I don't know what was over here, really. I didn't, like... There's no, like, exit point, I don't think. Well, we can climb up, I guess. This just feels like bad news bears, doesn't it? I got a feeling. Let's go. My game just kind of... It's like it glitched, almost. What is up here? Ooh, that must just mean that the thing I got earlier does more damage, essentially. Yeah. Oh, it has his jump attacks. Now, that might be good for some of the uh, jump heavy hit spamage. You know what I'm saying? All right, that is it for now. Thank you so much for watching. Kind of a odd ending. I, I didn't really know where to stop it. I don't want the video. I saw the timer, and I was like, man, I don't want to make the video too long because um, I could just keep exploring this castle forever. So when we come back next time, 
I'll either be close to where I was in this at the end right here. Um, we just got that item, and then I stopped. So, I uh, love you all. Best lanes ever. See you next time. Peace.